Hello everyone. In today's video, we're going to talk about big maths. Now, in primary, we do big maths every week. Um, it's a very exciting part of the week for our students because they really enjoy it. Um, we have uh, two different types of big maths. We have the speedy, which is what we're looking at now, the speedy uh, number, beat that, additions and multiplications. And we also have um, the, the clicks, which we have 10 questions where we ask the children to use different methods to answer the calculations. Okay, now in today's video, I'm going to explain a little bit about how we do this and how we want our children to tackle big maths. So let's have a look. Here is the, an example of a big maths uh, sheet that your child will receive, okay? For year two, there are 40 questions and there are 90 seconds to complete the 40 questions. So we set the timer and the children set to work at these uh, multiplications and additions. Now let's have a look. We need to look at the different columns that are available for our students here, okay? Now, we have additions and we have multiplications. Now there's many ways that we can tackle big maths. We can go down, we can go across, we can answer all of the questions we know. Okay? Now, what we recommend to our students is find the questions you know the answers to really quickly and answer those first. So, for example, okay, first column, 9 times 2, 18, uh, 2 times 10, 20, 6 times 2, 12, 5 times 4, 20. So, don't know that one. 5 times 5, 25. 5 times 10, 50. Okay? Now, what we want is for our children to be able to find the questions they know straight away. In this way, they will become more confident. They will answer more questions across the chart. They do not have to answer every single question in every single spot in the first go, the second time, the third time. It takes time to practice and to answer the questions. We want our children to practice all the time, their times tables and their additions. So whichever way works for your child, across, down, diagonal, answering all of the questions that they know straight away. Find the multiply by tens, find the multiply by twos. All of those ones can be done very easily very quickly and the children can get lots of points which makes them feel confident and then they try again next time to beat their score okay let's see how many i got one two three four five six seven i did seven questions so i'm going to pop my seven here and then hopefully next time i'll get a better score okay so keep practicing thank you